Hello everyone, Platinum here back in the video. Today we are going to be building like a sea serpent and you can actually turn it into a shark or whatever because you can just, you know, make the head and stuff. So, <clears throat> this is basically just going to be one big tail uh, because, because all the tail mechanisms I've done in my previous mech videos, that's what's going to be going on here. My throat is really dry, oh my goodness. <clears throat> I think I'm catching a little bit of a cold, so that that that's not that's not good. So we're gonna start off with the center of the body, not just the head. So I, I'm thinking this will be the neck. <coughs> Please don't do that. There we go. Skill tool always loves to trick you, and I need to move my keyboard because my mouse has like no space. I think we're gonna use the wheel tactic for this mech because that just generally works better. So here's the neck. I'm gonna do the head because the head is usually the quote unquote hardest part. Hold on, let me just figure out what I'm gonna do here. Let's put it like that and then that. Yeah, that, that about works the easiest for me. And now I will start doing the head. So the head is going to be a little bit like a dinosaur head. And you also need to add butter to make sure that the head doesn't fall. The head shape, we will uh, do an exoskeleton. So that would be pretty nice. Alright, so that's the head uh, size. Now we should add the snout. It's gonna look a little bit like the baby dragon we did in the last video. It's gonna be very slim. A bit like that. Now we should. And is that no that's not that's not good. There we go. Now we just have to just kinda put this together like this. There we go. Okay. This head's actually surprisingly gonna be the easiest part. There we go. Well, well, when I mean, when I say easy, I, I meant the quickest, because the boy is going to take ages, and so is the, uh, the spines going down the sea serpent. That is not cool. There we go. And... No, that's... Yeah, we'll just do it like that. Mm. Sorry if my voice is, voice is a little bit croaky. I'm just, you know, kind of sick. And being sick sucks, except for the fact that you get to stay in school. Huh. No, I don't know where to put the eyes, really. I feel like they belong, like, here. Like, right there. Yeah, that doesn't look that good. Yeah, that, that looks better. We'll just do it like that. Okay, mm. let's see. So we need the the other part of the eye. It's like, yeah, that bit. Maybe we'll just do it by one. And there. Okay. So we have the head, and now we get something that looks like a pupil, maybe? Kind of like that, but that looks a bit strange, so I don't know how to, I'll, I'll just leave it like that, why not? 
So I'm going to use these for the teeth. Because if we don't add these, it'll look like it doesn't have a mouth. And... Yeah, that's... That's... that's. <laughs> he looks derpy, but whatever. <laughs> that's funny. I think fireworks can actually uh, act as good people's. It might sound weird, but it's true. So, apparently, we find where the eye is, and we can kind of do something like that. Where even is that going? Oh, we need some a little bit deeper. Go to sink it in. No, that's still not good enough. Maybe we can just do it from here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now, we can actually do the eyes. So we just wait until there. Then, we can start doing the eyes. There we go. He's looking down. And we're going to try and make him look not scary. You can make you guys can make him scary if you want, but just like that. Oh gosh, that looks a bit weird. So it's going to be Yeah, the eyes are a bit too bright. Yeah, that's going to be what his eyes look like. So we need to do that on the other side as well. But before that, I will just do this bit. Pupils need to be here. So then we do that. We do that. There we go. Now I want to know if we can actually make the eye have color and see what it looks like. Oh, that actually doesn't look that bad. But that looks a bit better. I want to add some color to the eyes. There we go. <laughs> he looks cool. I like it. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so, I think I'm actually going to make the eyes a bit bigger now. Okay, so it's like... Ah! Oh, it's so hard to, to add on to it. Okay, let's just go from here. The eye is in my way, though. There we go. No. Okay. Oh, he looks kind of cute. Huh. No, why are all my builds so cute? Like, look at this guy. Look at this little guy. Oh. So cute. Now we just do that on this side. Okay. That good? Nope. Used to be a bit farther up. So, like, no, it still needs to be a bit farther up. Like that. Yeah, there you go. Okay, now I place it a bit far from, um, where we, oh, ri oh my gosh. Ah. Uh, okay. Th th there. There. I'll just leave the other firework in. Okay. Now we can just start adding on. Okay. 
Okay, so it's one, two, three, four blocks. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we got the size. Now it's the eye actually starts at about. Gosh, it's so hard. It actually starts at about there. Where did that even? Oh, oh, there. The eye starts about there, like that. Okay, now how tall is it? Okay, one, two, three, four. It's so a four by four. So like this, there we go, and then it has a little bit of the color, go, and we'll just add a bit of that, go, wonder what happens, okay, we don't want them too cute, okay, let's just, yeah, let's leave them at that, so we got the eyes of the sea serpent, now we actually start building the body. So the body pretty much a repetitive cycle of this. So I'll just make the skeleton type of thing first. Um yeah, I guess I can do that. We want him really long long though. Cause sea serpents are, are kinda long. Okay, there we go. Ah! Stop falling, okay? Just, yeah. Stay. Oop. So the body goes up to about there. And it keeps getting smaller. And then finally, it ends at about there. And then the final bit. Okay, so that's the skeleton finished. Wow, he's big. Okay. Ah! Yeah, like that. Okay. Now. Ah! No, no. There you go. So now we just build on from those. Oh my gosh, I'm not using a scaling tool. It's a, it's, it's a miracle. How am I we how am I welding this power? My goodness. I am strong. Whoa, this this is this power. I feel powerful. Jeez. That was some power there. Oh gosh, we need to fill in those gaps when we're done with the thingy majiggy. Hello, Mr. Ghidorah. How are you doing? Or Ghidorah. How do you say the name? I don't even know. Here we go. Okay. Now we just have to do this bit. Pop, 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 pop. There we go. Now we just have to do this. Scale tool is just quicker for these long bits, but I won't use scale tool for this bit. There you go. Cool, okay. Now we do butter. Okay, it's going pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. It's 
especially the eyes. I like the eyes. It looks kind of friendly. It's a very friendly and wholesome sea serpent. Pop. The th the, e the good thing is it goes it gets easier uh, um as you progress with the tail. There we go. Okay, we're pretty much done the tail. Now we just may add the uh f the blocks to fill in the gaps and then the sail kind of things and then we should be done. Uh yeah, we'll just do it one by one like this. They'll just make it less robotic, I guess. I don't know the word for it. Don't fill in the gaps by the wheels, though. That'll make it look bad. And I mean, it won't make it look bad. It'll just make it w work a lot worse. Okay, now we just do these ones. Like this. The butter makes it a bit harder. But if you just do that, then it's fine. There we go. Now this. Boop. Okay, now we go inside of the butter and then we place it like that. There we go. Now we do this bit. Cool. And this bit, does it need, this bit doesn't really need it. Okay. Now time for the part that makes it look way better. The sails. The sails are quite important. Well, they're not important, like, for the building. They're just important for detail. There we go. Okay, now to fill in the sails, I'm thinking we use these like that. Sails like kind of go down a bit, like that. How does it look? Yeah, that looks okay. Like we can make it better by doing this. We won't do that just yet. And for this bit, I will do that. There we go. You just kind of make them all look like they're attaching to each other. Like that. And it'll make the sales, the sales a lot better. go and the thing is the good thing about sails is that even no matter how close they are they won't uh limit the turning like the the bend of the serpent so it'll bend just as far so that's really good And like that, like that, and boosh. Okay, now we will just fill it in a bit like this. For these ones, uh, we do it very low, and then to connect the low ones with the big ones we just do something like that now we go inside the butter try and do that yeah okay so we got our sea serpent we can add some fins too Boop, 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 boop. 
Okay. Next fin, we do the same thing. So it's about in the middle. So about there. Like that. Yeah. Now we fill this in. There we go. Okay, so now we just paint it, and then we will be done. I'm pretty sure. Wazam! I have finished painting my amazing serpent, and uh, I think he looks cool. I gave him like a reddish, uh, scaly back. And, um, I would love to see how you guys made your serpent. Now, you may be wondering, geez, how do I let you see? Well, um, what you can do is you can actually go into my Discord, link in the description below, and you could submit your serpent in the post section, and I will see it, and I'm going to be like, wow, good job. So, anyways, we need to test. So, we go into a crack. We put a chair down. Now, I'm not on a white team, so I don't know if this is facing the right way. Nope. Okay, let's see. That must face be facing the right way. Yeah. Yep, there we go. So remember to save because saving is important. Bam, boop, there we go. Okay. So now we can get a button and let this go. Now, if you don't, if you put a normal button, it's gonna activate uh, these. So make sure you're on like a completely different color from the eyes. You paint the butter, and then you can press it. So I'll put the, I'll paint these blue. Like that, 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 that. Okay, now when we press the blue button, it will def it'll delete all the butter, but not the eyes. Further up here, then we can start using normal buttons. And then we would just do that and press this. Okay, so our sea serpent is ready to swim. So we get in here. We sit. Ah! Okay, serpent. I'm just gonna put more of these on you because apparently it's not enough. You ready? Swim. Oh my gosh, I can actually control him. Go on, our serpent, go, swim. Swim, my serpent. Swim. Oh my gosh, he's swimming. Go, serpent, go. Go, serpent. Woo. Oh, this is so good. Can he fly? He can fly. Oh, this is the best. Go, serpent, go. He can fly. But guess what? He can also swim. Swim, serpent, swim. Oh, this is good.